Welcome back, my beautiful people of the internet. There is a couple of things we need to talk about today. Amongst other things, so stay with me, we have an update for the Galaxy Watch 6 happening right now, which really took me a long, long time to install compared to the size of the update and what the changelog really is revealing to us. What we do know, though, is one thing has been fixed, and that is the spelling mistake Samsung did when they ship the Galaxy Watch 6 on one of their watch faces. It says April with, I don't know, double P, double R, whatever. It has been fixed now with this update. But hang on, hang on. Because it took such a long time to install, there might actually be more behind all of that. I will, of course, test the battery life again starting today to see if there has been something applied we simply don't know about. You know what? Companies do these things sometimes secretly behind closed doors. And when you go back and say, well, well, we all have issues with our battery life they say well nothing really happening here right so let's see what's going on whilst uploading this video i saw this message somebody posted that the samsung health app has an update available i do know that in order to fix the sleep tracking we need an update via the samsung health app please make sure to check that as well this may be really good news if you make use of the temperature sensor that has been built in galaxy watch 6 and 5 of course and use the app that is called thermocheck that app has now a dedicated tile you can use but hang on there's more they changed something in the app or they changed something when you use the app itself that change is really helpful though when you go in now and you want to measure something you hold it obviously against something if you don't go into the water and you want to measure your food you now have a small blinking dot that will show you where the temperature sensor is located the temperature sensor itself obviously doesn't move but every time you want to measure something you can then see okay it's right here i can hold it a bit differently and see what the temperature is like there is another Wear OS app you can download in the google play store for free that lets you create custom watch faces i know it doesn't sound unique but hear me out it really is unique and this app is not limited to the Galaxy Watch itself. All you need to have on your watch installed is Wear OS 2.5 or higher. The app itself comes with a starter package, if you like. It has skins already, a few presets, custom text and shapes, you name it. Basically, you have the ability to use image files to help you create the watch face you desire. And this is what the developers are saying here. The uniqueness about that is basically you can display any, and I mean any data you want or need with animations you can create customized digital and analog clocks with second hand animated patterns live map backgrounds weather which is sophisticated cpu slash memory meters if you like that and much more and they're saying the imagination is the limit which sounds pretty cool to me basically anything goes with this app and the app itself is called kwch and it is the custom watch face maker available in the google play store right now for free thank you for watching as always it has been a pleasure to see you again see you next time peace